Hi friends, welcome to Over Studies YouTube channel. This is part 52 in Python playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about how to write data into files in Python or how to create a file using Python. That means using Python language, if you want to write data into any file, then how to do that. And also if you want to create a new file altogether, then how to do that. So let's try to understand this. If you haven't watched my previous videos where I have explained like about this open function in part 49th video and also the part 50, 51 videos, please watch them because there I explained about this open function and how to read the content from the file, everything I discussed there. So this is like in a way like a continuation video to previous videos. So as I said in my past video, we can use this modes A and W when you perform write operation on top of your file. That means if you want to append data to the file, then inside this open function, you need to use this A mode. If you want to write data, that means override, delete the existing data and if you want to write the new data, then you need to use this mode W in the open function. Let me practically show you that so that you will make sense of it. Let me go to Visual Studio code here. So if you remember, we have created a sample file.txt file in our past videos. And if you see here, this file contains hello world. Okay, so this is the content of the data right now in this file. So now what I will do, I will try to append the data into that file. So to do that, what I can do, firstly, use this open function and to the open function, pass the file file full path. In this case, my terminal is already in the Python lab folder and even this sample text file also in the same folder. So I no need to enter the full path. I can simply type my file name here. And then I am going to supply mode call A because I want to take that file into file object and I am saving that file object in a variable called my file. And I, I am opening that file using this mode A. That means I am opening that file to append the content to it. So now what I can do on top of my file object, I can use this write method. I can use this write method. To the inside the write method, I can pass the content. Maybe I want to write content called Mahir Basha. So let me save these changes. If you remember here, right now text file contains only hello world. Now let me execute this uh, code here. See, code executed successful. Now if I go to C, it appended Mahir Basha. What, what, what if I want to append the new line? Then what I can do here? Maybe I can add slash in here to get the new line and then the content, whatever you want to append. So let me save these changes. Now if I execute this code, see code executed successful. If I go here, it appended the new line as well. What if, if I want to, if I use this mode as W, that means it will write the content. That means whatever the content it already has, it is going to delete all the content and this new content is going to be placed there. See right now this sample text file contains this hello world Mahir Basha and Mahir Basha. Now I am using mode W. Now let me try to run this code and see what will happen. So let's run this code. Now code executed successful. If I go here, see all the old content was gone and the new content came. Why? Because write is actually it will overwrite the data. Okay. So not only this, if you want to create a new file, let's assume. Let's assume I want to create a new file. Then you can use mode called X here. That will actually create a new file. So let's assume I want to create a new file called sample file1.txt in the same path of the Python lab. So the moment I execute this code, it is going to create a new file, new code, new file here. You will see that the, my new file name is sample1.txt. And inside the new file, maybe I want to uh, write this content Mahir Basha. Or let's not do all this. Let's try to understand only creating a new file. Let me save these changes. Now, if I execute this code, closely observe my code executed successful. And if you see sample1.txt file cam. Not only this, uh, for example, if I use like append mode and uh, using append mode, I am trying to append some content into file. So let's let's use the same code like on my file object using this write method. And to the write method, I am supplying like Mahir Basha is the content what I am supplying. So what if I try to use this append on a file name which is not there. If you see sample file2.txt is not available. If I do this, what will happen? Since the file is not there, it will create a file with this name and then append the content to it. So let me execute this code now. See, now I, a code is executed. If you see sample2.txt file came and if I open this file, you can see the content called Mahir Basha there. Not only this, even if I use this w to w mode also, if the file is not available, then it will create a new file. So let's try to use sample file 3. See, sample file 3 is not available. So what it will do? It will create a new file and it will add, write this content to there. So let me execute this code to practically see that. See, it created a new file. And if you see inside the file, it written the code as well. So this is actually it will work. So if I go to presentation, the same thing I have explained here. See here, 
am opening a file with the append mode i am appending the content to it and once you append you can use this read method to see whether the data got appended or not r is the mode to read the content of it so similarly w is the mode which will help you to overwrite the content inside the file and to create any new file you can use x a w so a and w will be used when the file is not available it will create a new file and add the content x will be uh, going to create a new file when the file is not available if file is already available then it is going to throw the error let me practically show you that see let's assume i want to create a new file called sample3.txt using the mode x since this sample3.txt is already available it is going to give error so let me execute this code now see it thrown error saying file exist file is already exist okay so this is how using this open function and multiple modes you either create a files or write data to the files i hope you understood this video thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the notification whenever i add videos thank you so much